We've worked on the soft touch, we've worked on the wide movements, worked on controlling the puck on the side and in front. Now the last piece to be really good with the puck is controlling the puck with all parts of the blades. So we gotta go forehand, we gotta go backhand, we gotta go heel, toe, and heel, and toe on the backhand as well. So we're gonna start with the toe drags. That is, of course, the ultimate use of the toe of the blade. So to start, we're gonna make it pretty simple. You can see I have the speed deke set up in a bit of an L shape, an upside down L. So all I want you to do is start with the puck in front of the speed deke. What's really important here is your accuracy of your movement. And this comes with practice. The more you do it, the more accurate you'll be. At first, you're gonna start and you're gonna miss the puck a little bit right there. You're gonna miss the little puck a little bit right there. But the more you practice, the better you'll get at getting your blade right there in front of the puck and pulling back. Once we're right here, we're gonna pull back with both hands. And what's really important is the movement of the top hand. What I need to do is roll that top hand and have it on the ice before the puck gets there so I have my forehand presented just like that. So you can see pull, catch, pull, catch, pull, catch. At the beginning, you might not be that quick. You might pull it back and miss the puck. All you have to do is keep practicing that nice quick snap back and you're going to get this. See if I can do it with my head up. Once you get comfortable with this, you can work a little movement into it so you can rock a little bit side to side because you don't want to only practice it with your body perfectly centered. When you're on the ice, you never know when you're gonna have to pull off that toe drag. You can start with your weight on this foot. You can pull it in, move it across. You can add some combinations to this to make it a little bit more game-like. That's the toe drag in front, but remember you have to work on moving the puck in all directions. So we ha also have to go that way. So in this one, we're gonna push the puck off to the side. Now, instead of pulling it back, we're pulling it in towards the body from the side. So a very similar motion, except we're just reaching out like this with our hands. When you pull in, you have to pop this top hand out like that. So you can see it's closer to my body right here. When I pull that puck in, I'm pushing that top hand out and pointing like that. And that allows me to get my blade flat so I can catch the puck right there. Once you get pretty good on the side and the front, then you can do a combo. I like to call this the yo-yo. You're gonna pull it back here, push it out to the side, pull it in from the side, push it out to the front. And just keep on repeating, trying to get it under the speed deke, ah, every single time. And don't worry if you make mistakes, that's part of training. 